In this class, we are going to look at how to update the content of a lookup in Oracle integration with the help of REST APIs provided by Oracle. For demonstration purpose, I am considering this employee lookup which I have created. Let me open and show you the content of this lookup as of now. So this lookup is having two columns, one is a name and the role and I have populated few employees over here with their roles. Now in order to update the lookup with the help of REST API, we have to go to Oracle's documentation page and get the details. I am here in the official documentation page by Oracle on REST APIs for Oracle integration. From the table of content, we have to select lookups. Under lookups, we have to select update a lookup. There is a REST API provided by Oracle with HTTP method put and this is the relative URI. And there is some sample request and response details provided. We can have a look at this in order to update the lookup with the help of APIs. Now I will copy this URI from here, go back to Postman client and paste it over here. So this name we have to replace with the lookup name. I'm copying this lookup name from here, pasting it over here. Now in the body we have to pass the JSON data as JSON data is supported by this API. Now in order to get the sample JSON we can scroll down and copy this. Go back to notepad plus plus and I'm removing the quotation at the end and let me format this. So here we need to pass the name of lookup again and the columns, what and all columns it has to create or update in the lookup and the details. We have to pass details or the data for all the rows even if we are updating a lookup else that data will be lost. I will explain you how it looks like. In order to save time, I have populated the details like columns. I am having two columns. One is a name and the role that is name and role. And I have populated four employee details. Let me copy this from here and paste it in the body. And the HTTP method I have selected as put. As of now, I am not altering any details for any of the employees. So Rajesh is software developer, Razak is the software tester and so on and so forth. I am clicking on the send button. Now if I go back and refresh, there won't be any change. Details are intact. Now let me verify details for Khalik. I will remove software tester to software manager. And I will sit, click on this send button. Let me now verify this lookup. As you can see the details for Khalik, Khalik's role is now changed to software manager. Now I will try to add one more employee over here with the help of REST API. Let me copy the sample from here and paste. Here I will add Adam who is a software architect and click on send. 204 status. Now let me refresh this lookup. Now as you can see, employee Adam has been added with the role as software architect. Now suppose at the time of updation, we are not considering the details for one of the employees like this. Let me remove the details for Khalik and click on send. Status is 204. Let me refresh this lookup now. As you can see, the details for Khalik is now wiped off from this lookup. So like this, with the help of REST APIs, we can update a lookup in Oracle integration.